Okay, now just by hearing or seeing the title of this video, you probably are like, is it really possible to make um, HTML tags? Well, it is, and I'm going to teach you. This is a video that you've probably never seen before, and I'm doing something new. So, I'm just going to make the sample website for it called website, sample website. And every website you make has to have a CSS folder. And in that CSS folder, you want to make a new folder and call it HTML tags. Then HTML attributes. Now, HTML tags are unexisting tags with new or existing attributes and HTML attributes are existing tags with new attributes. You could you could put all of this in your C local disk C and find it on every website you want. But here's what we have so far. Now we today I'm gonna be using Sublime Text too which you can get, you can just search Google Sublime Text instead of Notepad. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to make three new files. Okay, save this one. As index.html, this one as tags.css and this one as attributes attributes.css so that's all we need right now and the first thing we do is Obviously, you do the doc type, which is the start of every HTML website. Sorry about that bump. Now, in this one, in this video, the head's basically the most important tag. So, in my clipboard, I have some links, and all it's saying is link rel equals style sheet, style sheet type equals text slash CSS, and hyperlink reference equals CSS slash HTML tags slash tags dot css and then we're just going to copy that and do attributes Okay, so now let's start the body and first we're going to make a 
tag called text and we'll do text deck equals um underline but i think you can already do an html tag that is underlined so that's what you have to um go through is because there's a lot of html tags already and you want to make one that's new so there's no uh just red yet and then the text color will be red so That'll be our first new tag. This is a simple tag to make. A really simple tag to make. All you do is have to go into your HTML tags and do red. And then color red. And then save both of these files. And then open up your index file. Oh yeah, sample website. So now it's red. But if we take away that and save it, it's black and the tags red so that's our first tag it's just called red so this is a sample tag where the color is red I'm gonna make something where you download tags and then the computer will all automatically go to it so that's our first tag I'll save this and save index So we're going to make another one. This time we're going to do an attribute. I'll make a page break. And we'll do font deck for decoration equals um, line under. Let's close it here. Line. We'll I'll call it OL for overline. But that's also for order list, so I'll do over line. You can do whatever you want, which is pretty cool. And then this is a sample attribute for overline these are all style attributes so um when you get to download them in the future uh, you don't have to do css you just use style with html there's a lot like that right now so now let's just see what it looks like now the index file and it's black no overline or anything so we'll go into our attributes and we'll do font deck equals overline And then text decoration making tags is really that easy and then let's look at it now there's a line over it it kind of looks like there's a line separating it when that's it could just be an HR tag um so you can just explore making tags and attributes by yourself this was just a sample to get you started and 
remember to remember to comment, subscribe, and smack those thumbs up. See ya.